transport truck Guess what, you're in luck Frontier Motors is down the street Got the best deals that can't be beat Don't overpay, come in today Doing business the old-fashioned way Frontier, we got the right price Frontier, we'll treat you mighty nice Frontier Motors, low overhead Frontier. I've heard that talk about cars right. A lot of different ones And they all say the same thing They all say they got the best deal They all say, say they make it easy for you to buy a car But when you get there it's a complete pain in the butt, and they revert back to the old ways of doing business. If you come to Frontier Motors, we'd make it really easy for you. You can shop our lot without getting hassled by a salesman. You can walk around. All of our salespeople has a, have a price list in their back pocket that they can borrow you if you don't want to be bothered. A lot of people like shopping on Sundays because most dealerships are closed. You can actually shop during the week when we're open and not get hassled. And the other thing we'll do is give you a price in writing with all of the fees in there, which is somewhat unheard of. You know, you get the little business card and the guy scribbles something on there and you don't know if they're really going to come through with it or not. But we really make it easy and, believe it or not, make it fun to buy a car. And we're proud of that. We're proud that you can get a price, just like Ivan said, right away when you get to the, uh, to the car lot. And we're also proud that you can do it on the Internet. We have a wonderful website, FrontierMotorsInc.com. As Ivan said, you could Google Frontier Motors and come right to our dealership. But we really have worked on this. Now, I'm not saying probably two, three years ago we weren't doing it, but this, this last year here, we really worked on it where if you want a price or something, you need an answer, we have somebody there. You could actually actually go to a chat line. If you go to our website, FrontierMotorsInc.com, there's a place that you can chat and get your answer immediately or just call the number on there. The number is answered uh, just about any time it's got light outside, and uh, so you can get your answers right away. The other thing that makes us different and really different than anybody on the Gulf Coast is we have 300 plus vehicles in stock. Now, what does that mean to you, the public? Uh, that means the selection is excellent. And most people have that image, Ivan, you're talking about used cars and used car salesmen, that if you go buy a used car, that it's going to have tons of miles or it's going to be old. Right now, in stock, out of that 300 cars, we have 40 cars under 12,000 miles. 40 under 12,000 miles. We have 84 SUVs, cars, trucks, 84 under 25,000 miles. And I was looking over um, in year models. We have four 2010s. We're not a new car dealer. Like I said, we're a used car independent dealer. 37 2009s. Some people don't even have 37 cars on their lot. And 52 2008s. Now, Ivan has just bought about uh, 14 or 15 more cars yesterday, so those aren't even counted. And that inventory helps you, the consumer. Does it help us sell a few cars? Yes. But it helps you, the consumer, make up your mind because if you're looking for a Toyota Corolla, we got one. If you're looking for Nissan Sentra, we got one. If you're looking at a Honda Civic, we got one. If you're looking for a Honda Elantra, we got one. And you can drive all of those at one location. And Ivan always says, you don't have to go from dealer to dealer to dealer, meet the, sales, the salesman, the sales manager, and the guru in the back with the three-piece suit before you leave. You can come to one location, and you can, you can walk the lot with a salesperson or without, which is, I think is huge. You can join us on the show by dialing 478-3116 uh, for the radio show I'm talking about. If you're watching us on TV, don't call now. If you're watching us on TV, call 436-8080. We can give you the value of your car. All the way back to 1991, we have the NED guides with us. And these guides are not the same thing that you can get on the Internet. They do have a version of the NED on the Internet, but it's a little bit different. These are the books that the insurance companies, credit unions, and bank use. And very, very important if you get a car that's totaled, or maybe somebody steals your car, or if there's a flood or something like that, the, the car gets wiped out. You want to know what you should get from the insurance company. We can actually put this in writing. Most dealerships won't talk to you about things like that because it's giving information for, away for free. And most dealerships open their doors because they want to sell you a car. What we do is we help people in the Pensacola area, whether they buy a car from us or not. I know it's hard to believe, but if you're going to buy a brand spanking new car, we have the new car cost guides that we bring to the radio show and the TV show right now. And these cost guides give us the retail and the um, dealer cost of any car out there. I also have with us the automotive news. And the automotive news gives me the rebates and the incentives to any franchise out there, which is very helpful because some of the rebates aren't advertised. There are such things called dealer incentives, and those are the incentives the dealer get to either drop the price of the car, make more money on the car, use the money for advertising, use it to give you more money for your trade-in. But I think the number one thing that we offer the people out there is that if you're going to buy a brand new car somewhere in the Pensacola area, why not find out what that trade-in should be appraised for? And the way to do that is either call the show, 478-3116 or stop in at Frontier Motors at 230 Beverly Parkway. We will walk around the car. We will do a free history report 
for the car you're either buying or selling, and we will tell you what to either sell the car for if you're not outright, what to uh, what, a de- what you should expect for a trade-in if you happen to be buying another car. It could be a new car or a used car or maybe a private individual's car. What, you, what are you going to do if you're going to buy a private individual's car? You're going to bring us the car, and we might just write you a check for the car because maybe that's the car that we need for our lot. Yeah, you're talking about checking the history. Uh, Joe Kalia, one of our salespeople, had a customer that took up this offer off of the TV show, and uh, they go by our lot all the time. They live down the street down there by Michigan Avenue. So the neighbor had a car for sale, and so they got it, just like we told them to do, come over to the Frontier Motors, who ran the serial number, ran an auto check, checked values. The values were great. It was an excellent deal. It was something that probably we couldn't even beat because, of course, it was an individual. I don't have any overhead. They don't have anything, you know. <laughs> but the next thing is we pulled up that history report. Two accidents, and it was in a flood zone. Now, I don't know if that all means anything because it could be a minor accident. We pulled uh, history reports and we found out that the bumper cover was, but it changed this lady's outlook on this car, and that's what you have to be careful. We're not saying don't buy this car now. Now ask these questions to figure out what happened with this, and we do the same thing. We might pull a history report on something you trade in and find out it was an accident, but we're not embarrassed, or we don't want to embarrass you by asking you, hey, what happened? If it was a bumper cover, we had one lady that actually told us one time we were trading a car. It came up rear end accident, and we went, oh, no, we can't buy this car. They hit the trailer hitch ball. That's, they didn't even hit the bumper. It never even cost them money. But it was on the report because this, the state of Florida called the Highway Patrol because her husband was a, a, a sheriff. And they said, don't leave that scene or let you call on a sheriff. So those are things that you got to watch out for. And those are things that are absolutely free at Frontier Motors. So if you need something like that. You'll see, on the, if you're watching TV, you'll see the number running across the bottom of the screen. If you're listening to us on the show, you can call the dealership at 436-8080. And this is like I've said, if you want to join us on the show, 478-3116. And one of the things that uh, we can also do for you is we can uh, do a, what we call a locate. And a locate means that if you don't see the car you want in the, in the Pensacola area, you don't want to go to Atlanta or Orlando or some of the bigger markets to find a car. Um, just give us a try and let us buy the car for you. Ron did this morning with a, uh, a customer that has been looking for a Toyota RAV4, um, and she wanted a limited six-cylinder, and she wanted a, an 08 or an 09, had to left less than 20,000 miles on it. She went to the Toyota store, and she found out how much a new one is, and she says, I really don't want to buy a brand new one. I think I can save about four to $5,000 on a one-year-old car, and they didn't have one. So she got on the Internet, she found some in California, and she found some all over the place, but none in our area. And she was also a little bit leery about buying one on eBay because on eBay, you gotta, when you put the hammer down, you do that buy it now thing, guess what? You own it. And at that point, they're going to ship it to you, and you're going to send them the money before you even get the vehicle. And that's a little unnerving. What we did, what Ron did, is he found one in Atlanta. Um, we bought it this morning, and we're going to get the vehicle here, and then she's going to be able to get it inspected um, if she wants to take over the Bobby Lycus or her mechanic to make sure that there's no issues with it. Of course, it's under factory warranty, right. so we're not worried if a power window doesn't work or something like that. What she wants to do is get inspected and make sure that the problem areas that people are nervous about, especially in our area, is has it ever had flood damage? Has there ever been an accident? Is there any problems with the vehicles? We will guarantee that we'll never sell a flood damaged vehicle. If we do, we'll buy it back from you. We'll guarantee that we'll never sell you a car that has a odometer discrepancy if it's not noted on the title. That's one of the things also that the history reports do. If you do a pull a history report on the car and you pay for that history report, you actually get a guarantee that they will catch it or you get your money back. And that's t- kind of takes the pressure off of you buying a car that's not disclosed properly. We talked earlier about the Internet and what we're trying to do in making it as easy as possible for you that are using the Internet. The newest thing we've got is this personal.